beloved brothers and sisters, we have gathered this evening to just do one thing. We have gathered to pray. Estamos aquí esta tarde para realizar solamente una cosa. Y esta cosa es la oración. And the highest form of prayer is the Holy Mass. The offering that Jesus himself did before he died. He offered himself for the salvation of mankind. La Santa Misa es una celebración que Jesús mismo nos dejó ofreciendo a sí mismo. And whenever we celebrate the Holy Eucharist, we profess again our faith in Jesus. We recite after the consecration. Dying, you destroyed our death. Rising, you restored our life. Jesus, by offering himself by dying on the cross, he has destroyed death. And by rising from the dead, he has restored life. Muriendo en la cruz, Jesús ha destruido la muerte. Resucitando, él nos ha restaurado la vida. We are here this evening to ask the good Lord to grant a place of rest for our beloved ones. We know them why they were here on earth. They were part of our Catholic community. They came to mass like us. They listened to the word of God. They prayed for other people. I see the picture of Valoris here. She was always coming to this mass because those who recite rosaries in a group on Monday, on Mondays they will always be here every time we celebrate the bereavement mass. Veloris will always sit with her companions at this particular mass. But the Lord called her home to himself. And today, I was privileged to attend the funeral of Father Patrick Guillen, Patricio. Padre Patricio, él vivió hasta 89 años. Ahí en Riverside, in the Church of Holy Angels in Riverside, where the funeral mass was celebrated at 10 o'clock this morning. During the mass, a thought came to me, and it was a holy thought and gave me a holy joy. I said, yes, we are missing Father Patricio. We are missing him. We are going to miss him so dearly. But some people are rejoicing. The angels are rejoicing. The saints are rejoicing that he is going to be in their company. It's a loss for us, but a gain for the angels and the saints. He finished his own work here on earth, his mission. Él terminó su trabajo aquí. Él trabajó incansablemente como un sacerdote. Llevó a muchos a la santidad. And another holy thought that came to me was that all those people, Father, when he lived, he was praying for, they were in return pray for him. The holy souls in purgatory, those he anointed before they died, those he ministered to, those he came in contact with, they will remember him. Remember that 
It is not out of place that we pray for the souls in purgatory. We tell them to remember us. Or we pray that Jesus will remember our beloved dead. It's not out of place. It is in the Bible. We know the good thief, the man who made a mistake in his life, a sinner. He was killed because of his sin. He was about to die because of his sin. The punishment due to his sin, the thief was crucified. A ladron came, recibió a pago de su carácter. Estaba a punto de morir. Él decía, Jesús, Jesús, recuérdame cuando entres en tu reino. Jesus, remember me when you enter into your kingdom. And Jesus responded to him immediately, I will today, I will remember you. I will be with you in paradise. Yo quedaré contigo in a paraíso hoy. Beloved brothers, this is what we have come to do. We are telling God, remember our brothers and sisters, those whose features are here, those that we carry in our hearts. Lord, remember them. Lord, have mercy on them. Lord, do not forget them. Lord, be mindful of them. Señor, receive their legs. Tenga misericordia de ellos. Señor, perdona legs sus pecados. Este es la razón por la cual hemos venido. The love of God is inexhaustible. The mercy of God is inexhaustible. We cannot judge God the way we judge ourselves. God is not like us. Sometimes we may not forgive people. Sometimes it may take us years to forgive people. God is not like that. El Señor no es así. No tenemos que utilizar nuestras lógicas, nuestros constructos culturales para mirar a Dios. We cannot use our own way of looking at things and our own way of judgment and our cultural constructs, the way we think and we impose it onto our God. Our God is merciful. We only need to realize how merciful the Lord is. And here at the church of St. The Holy Angels in Riverside, I was so happy. The little six bancas, las bancas, piedras, you know, a six made up of stones, they wrote on those six outside, Jesus, I trust in you. You can go and see. And I went and I sat in one of them. I said, Jesus, I trust in you. Around the church, Jesus, I trust in you. Around the church premises, they believe in the mercy of God. Jesus, I trust in you. We can do similar things in our own community. How can we make our community a holy community? It's not a question of money. It's a question of having holy desires. It's a question of loving heaven. It's a question of making heaven present. It's not a question of dinero. No ex. La question de dinero. Es la question de quedarse llena de amor de Dios. De amor de Dios. Es la question de llenarse con el deseo de ir al cielo. Knowing that everything we have here on earth, we are not going to take to heaven. Except the good things we have done. 
except the good testimonies we have given, except the lives we have touched. Queridos, we still have time to fill ourselves with this holy joy. That the saints had when they were about to die. Some of them were so happy to go because they have already finished their work here. On the, they were happy to go and meet the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, the Alpha and the Omega. Ellos son inspiraciones para nosotros. Que no llenamos nuestras vidas con las basuras hoy. Y yo estaba mirando a Padre Patricio. I was saying, you know this man. He gave his life entirely for God, all his life. And he lived up to 89 years, and he loved the people of God, and he has gone. He doesn't have a son or a daughter. He doesn't have a house in Riverside and in Rancho Cucamonga. No casa in Las Vegas. No troque que está caminando allí. Nada. What he has, which is very fulfilling, is his love for God and for God's people. And God's people came today to pray for him. And this is wonderful to have that love of God. El amor hacia nuestro Dios. El amor al prójimo. Well, my brothers and sisters, if you have not started begin today to have that love of God, to be filled with the love of God, to have that love for your neighbor, to be filled with the love of your neighbor, to pray for those who may have made mistakes, Lord, have mercy on them. And the love of God will lead them to heaven. Que el Señor sigue dándonos oportunidad, que el Señor sigue haciendo su trabajo en nosotros para que un día con nuestros hermanos y hermanas podemos ver a Dios cara en cara en el cielo. So that at the end of our lives we may see God with our brothers and sisters face to face in heaven. And I sing this song telling our brothers that it is, and sisters that it is well with your soul. It is well, it is well with their souls with your souls, it is well, it is well, with your souls. Está bien, está bien, con sus amas, con sus amas, está bien, está bien. Con sus amas. Que nuestro Dios les conceda un descanso eterno ahora y para siempre. Amén.